And on to the corridors of justice where former Kenya Ports Authority Managing Director Daniel Manduku and a former officer Juma Fadili have been released on a 12 million shilling cash bill. The duo denied five graft related charges in the alleged loss of 923 million shillings. This comes as Malindi Court ordered Malindi Member of Parliament Aisha Jumo to present herself to the police to answer to graft related charges on Monday. Six Development Fund officials in Malindi were charged and released on a 5 million shilling cash bill. Among the graft allegations leveled against the former Kenya Ports Authority Managing Director Daniel Manduko and a junior officer Juma Fadili Chilugu are over 923 million shillings that cannot be accounted for from the 1.4 billion shillings contractual sum. The money is alleged to have been misappropriated in unlawful engagement in the procurement of manufacturing of concrete barriers and unlawfully preparing wax evaluation certificates that were erroneously occasioning an overpayment. Appearing before Chief Magistrate Lawrence Mugambi, the two pleaded not guilty to five accounts, which include conspiracy to commit an offense of corruption, engaging in a project without prior planning, willful failure to comply with applicable laws and procedures and guidelines relating to procurement and abuse of office. Chief Magistrate Lawrence Mugambi released the duo on a cash bill of 12 million shillings, an alternative bond of 30 million shillings. They are also required to deposit their passports and travel documents and are banned from accessing any public office. The mention will be on 25th of September 2020 to confirm that the defense has been served with all the evidential material that the prosecution intends to rely on. Elsewhere, Six Malindi constituency CDF officers were accused alongside Malindi MP Aishi Jumwa one Friday morning a rain before Mombasa Law Courts accused of misappropriating over 57.7 million shillings from the constituency development fund. Appearing before Chief Magistrate Edna Nyeloti, the six were charged with 10 counts of graft among the money laundering and conspiring to receive money falsely, which they denied and were released on a 5 million shillings cash bill or 10 million bond. Malindi MP Aisha Juma was not in court but was represented by a lawyer, Dunstan Omari. In explaining Juma's absence, he pointed out she learned about the arrest on social media and had not been duly summoned. Hakuwa kotini leo kwa sababu ambazo ni kwamba yeye hakuwa rifiwa. Kulingana na sheria za Kenya, lazima arifiwe. Hakuwa rifiwa. The magistrate ordered the legislator to present himself to the port police before appearing in court on Monday next week. Ama imetoa warrant, ika lift ile warrant, kwa hivyo Aisha Jumwa atakika na ende kwa polisi, tutamchukua, kisha tukimfikisha pale, atolewe vidale, afanyo ile processing, kisha aletwe kotini jumatat. The lawyer say they'll appeal the ruling on bail and bond on Monday, terming it exorbitant. Kwa sababu ile dhamana imepeanwa, ni dhamana kama ni kama kuwanyima wale wafu, wale wale oshitakiwa. Wale ni watu wachochole, wale ni makabuela, wale ni watu wachini, wale ni akinayahe, mshara yao ni shilingi elifu, thala, elifu kumi, elifu thalatina tisa, hadi elifu kumi. Wamuambia leo, Mtu mwenye sh, anakula mshahara shilingi elfu kumi, a, a, alete milioni tano. For Channel 1 News, I'm Serafina Robbie.